Hello, Creative Mama. Welcome to the Fully Me channel, or welcome back. My name is Giselle, and it is an honor to have you here with me. I wanted to just share a quick word of encouragement, uh, charge, and whatever else you want to fill in the blanks with. But today, I wanted to just jump on really quickly to say, create, 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 create. Um, there was this wonderful um quote that i that i came across while i was doing my my graduate studies for expressive arts therapy and the quote said that the your creativity is the immune system for your soul and so if you break that down to think about okay what is the immune system what does it do without going into all the scientific definitions of it just generalized understanding of what our immune system does it fights off bacteria it helps to protect it helps to keep us safe it helps to ward off anything that could cause our our demise right anything whether it's bacteria whether it is a virus um a little cold, something that enters into our body that does not belong there, the immune system immediately begins to attack it in order to get rid of it or alert us um, consciously in the way that we feel in our physicality to know that something is not right. And then we get to partner in helping to remove that thing, to stop eating that thing or in taking that thing or removing ourselves from whatever is causing um, dysfunction or dis-ease within our bodies physically. A lot of times when we think of our immune system, we're thinking of vitamins, vitamins help. We're thinking of food that have natural vitamins, supplements. We're thinking of exercising and moving our bodies and different aspects and different um, tools that we can use in order to support the health of our body and to support our immune system, keeping our body safe and running and functioning properly. So we take that same idea of the immune system and we flip it over and we consider this quote of creativity being the immune system of the soul. What could that mean? It's the same thing. So using your creativity, what it does is it helps to ward off things that would cause harm to your soul, cause harm to your mind emotionally, physically, right? They say what the soul is, is the, the heart, the mind, the will. I may be mixing that up. But when you think about mentally, emotionally, when you think about spiritually, the creativity, your creative gift, your interaction and creative um, explorations, that is helping to ward off and to keep your mind healthy, to keep your emotions healthy. It's bringing joy to you. It's bringing joy to your, to your life. It's really sparking that imagination. It's bringing you out of whatever your current circumstance may be, whether it's a wonderful one or whether it's not and it is allowing you it's almost like giving you vitamins to help sustain you creativity is one of the most it's kind of like it's under it's it's kind of like how can i explain this it is something that is taken for granted can be taken for granted very easily and sometimes often however it is one of the most potent tools that we could ever use and don't have to pay for that could really jumpstart our mental, emotional, physical health, that could really jumpstart and encourage positive health within our soul. And so I want to encourage you because as a creative mom, our children, as they say, they do what we do and not necessarily as we say, right? So I want to encourage you first and foremost, create create, create, create. Maybe it is something you feel like, oh, I'm good. I got this in the bag. This is my skill. Or maybe it's not, right? Getting out there, getting messy, trying something different, as long as it's a form of creation. And there's so many different um, stimuli. There's so many different modalities. There's so many different prompts that you can use, that you can try. However, I just want to encourage you for the health of your soul, for the health of your mind, your body, your will, your emotions, your physicality as well, create. And as you get yourself into a greater, more harmonious alignment, just more peace, 
more reasons to smile five minutes 10 minutes i really like to say 10 15 minutes right but it can be a five minute song that you put on and you dance to guess what dancing is creativity right it's giving you a reason to smile to laugh to let down that burden to let down some of the weight to let down some of the circumstances that you are carrying to let down some of those um, home life responsibilities that you may have or questions that you don't have answers for. It gives you a moment to help and to bring health to your soul, to that heart, mind, will, those emotions, right? It's giving you an opportunity to support your immune system, your soul's immune system. And that is through creativity. That quote has changed my life. I'm always going back to it. Um, at even two years now, it's still something that always brings me back to focus. And so I wanted to share that with you today. It doesn't have to be in your specific skill or talent that you feel like you have. It could be something so simple as dancing. It can be something so simple as picking up a coloring book. It can be something as so simple as trying your hand at writing a poem. It can be so simple as sitting down and allowing your imagination to run free on something that is amazing and you enjoy. And as you begin to lighten up by letting down some of those burdens, as you beginning to plump up your soul immune system, with more joy and more peace and more laughter, others around you will take notice and your life will begin to shift in some amazing ways and you'll find yourself a lot stronger in these areas than maybe you were before. What a great example for yourself. What a great example for your children. So I wanna encourage you today, create. There's no boundaries on what that looks like. Just do it. Until next time, please subscribe, share this with a friend, hit the notification button. Um, and when you do those things, know that you're helping to get these videos out and in front of other creative moms who can be encouraged by this as well. So until next time, live fully and create. Bye.